This summer, we tested out the new yacht. We went island hopping in the Bahamas, man. While we were in Boca Grande, I hit the jackpot. Look at that, baby. And they got my favorite, okay? We got about 30 plus million to spend. No oh boy, now she's gonna want a big tip. We're making it work. <laughs> nice arm workout today, I needed it. I'd say something, but Aaron's here. We're leaving the boat. Why are we leaving the boat? Because we gotta get to work. Can't play all the time. Today we're gonna go out, we're gonna see what the market is willing to offer us. Aaron's supposed to be finding us some deals to look at. We're in a 1031. We just sold a hotel and a piece of property on I Drive. We got about 30 plus million to spend. Can we replace it and with what? Let's find out. High five, homie. Carla needs to go get her nails done. I hate climbing in this stupid thing. You know, I don't know why people jack their trucks up high. Oh my God. One, two, three. And now uh, you have to spend so much money. You said this is not a good market for real estate, right? It's not, so that means I gotta work even harder. But I'm hoping that because it's not a good market and people also experience what I'm experiencing with the higher interest rates, then a lot of people are gonna be trying to get out of deals like I am. Hopefully there might be some value-add deals popping up. There might be some people that can't refinance. Maybe they'll have to sell it off cheap just to get rid of it and pay the bank back. I don't know. We gotta go out here and do our homework, see what's available, and find a diamond in the rough. That's what we gotta do. Just wanna make sure the diamond's not a zirconia. Could buy that hotel right there. Rooms are 79 a night right there, budget in. But they only rent by the hour. I turned down that Tesla dealership there. Good thing I did. I'd be paying to own it because the interest rate's so high now. the streets looking for the next hot deal. Aaron's been doing some research. He came up with a vacant car dealership right here in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. It's sitting at around seven and a half acres, but there's an extra two acres of parking lots across the street and down the road. A pretty big property. There's only one thing is the price. Well, price is negotiable. First, we'll look at it. Then we'll test the water and see if there's some room to make a good deal because we know a lot of people in the car business. Maybe we could talk to our folks, get them to commit to renting it. We buy it and then we already have our tenants and it all works out perfect. But the question is, can we get it for a good price? How much? 27 million. What? Well, you know, on this main street, with all the land you're getting, it could be possible. But that's what they're asking. And you don't always get what you're asked for. You don't believe me? Ask my wife. Only if you could find a tenant. Because if I could find a tenant before I buy it, then that's it. All the pieces of the puzzle are there. There's no risk. Typically, if this place was bought to say, I wouldn't say 27, they always ask too much. But let's say 20 million. For me to be worth paying 20 million bucks, I could rent this thing out probably for a seven cap, which would be a million four in rent a year. Divided by 12 is 116,000 a month. Somebody would have to pay me. And they have to pay the property tax and insurance. So it has to be a big money. shot that's gonna know he's gonna have a purpose for this place to make money. Plenty of guys out there in the car business that got mega millions. But it can only really be used as used car dealers because new car dealerships, I don't know much about it, but you can't just buy a place and put a new car dealership in it. But the used cars, it's great. In this place, you can drive and park cars on a friggin' level up there. You know how many cars you can fit here? A lot. It could be great if somebody just needed to store a bunch of cars. We got boat dealers too, so it could work maybe as Something with Maybe part of it can go to a boat guy, but I don't know. That, that property there, that would be actually, if they let you, be good for residential. Because it's not on the main street. You want traffic. If you're in business to sell stuff, you need eyes on your property. You want high traffic. We'll do our homework and find out. I think it's a good find. It's worth looking into. Let's see how far we can beat them down. Always do your homework, no matter what you're buying. And if you're not sure, Go to benmal.com slash shop and consult with Ben. Get me on the phone and we'll figure out how to do your homework. You looking for a good fight? Place your bets, place your bets. This weekend, YouTube star turned boxer Jake Paul returns to the ring to face Nate Diaz. Despite suffering his first loss against Tom Fury, the problem child enters as the heavy favorite once again on my bookie. Sports betting might seem complicated, but my bookie keeps it simple. Just back the money line on either side. When your fighter wins, you win too, baby.
see whether you're back in Paul or Diaz for this fight. Put the beer on ice. Get the boys together because absolutely nothing beats the thrill of betting with your buds. And you can do it all at MyBookie. Visit MyBookie.ag online. Use Mala to claim a deposit welcome bonus, baby. Just use Mala on your first deposit. Claim your bonus and start your weekend off with a W. And if you're still asking yourself, why should I choose my bookie over the competition? It's simple. They really do give you the best bang for your buck, period. Welcome to my bookie where every punch has the potential to be a game changer and every round holds a chance for you to win big. Bet anything, anytime, anywhere, only with my bookie. Good luck and always bet responsibly. Thank you, my bookie, for sponsoring this video. When Aaron drives, it reminds me of when I was a kid and my older brother would drive and my father would be sitting next to him and I'd be in the back seat of an old Chrysler. And whenever my brother drove, my father, I'm not kidding you, he literally held on to the dashboard like this when my brother drove. And that's what I just felt like doing when Aaron drives. <laughs> Where's Aaron taking us to dinner? We're stuck here in Fort Lauderdale. Are you in the mood for it? I don't care. 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 It's whatever Rafal Rafal. Don't let Rafal pick, because the last time he picked, we went to a Polish fucking restaurant in Montreal, Canada. Don't you dare even say that's me. pancakes, ah, they weren't Jewish style, crispy. The cheap on the sour cream and apple sauce. The pierogies, what the hell's a pierogi? A fucking dumpling, Russian Chinese dumpling. The schnitzel was very thin, cheapskates. We had to deliver Carla's wallet to her. All right, thank you. Look at her, she can't get up in there. <laughs> Mexican hillbillies. All right, go to Las Olas. That home can be yours with no yard for only $8,795,000. 85 are friends. I can't even put my boat there. And they want eight, almost nine million dollars. This is window shopping. Looking at homes that will fit your boat, fit your yacht. You gotta make sure you got enough dockage. Then every street here is different on the setbacks. You could be on one street and you got four, two foot setbacks. You could be on another street and you got four foot setbacks. Yeah, hey, I appreciate it. Tell him thanks for watching. Thank you. Yeah, he's actually. For Thank so you. Much. When are you gonna get your license? Uh, I'm not there yet, but he's been pushing me, honestly. You yeah. should. Why not? It's a license to make money. Yeah, exactly. You know? And women like this, they need money, baby. Yeah, you wanna go? <laughs> you know? We get free meatballs at Louis Borsi, baby. <laughs> free meatballs. Not just free meatballs. You said free. Meatballs. Free the best. And they're free. They're really the best. Not the pretty good meatballs. These meatballs are really good. You know why? Because the person that made them really gave a fuck. That's a pizza, okay? And fresh parmesan. Look at that. It comes in a big fancy can, too. Ooh, look at that. No oh boy, now she's gonna want a big tip. We're making it work. <laughs> nice arm workout today, I needed it. I'd say something, but Aaron's here. Oh. This is a slice. It's got cheese, it's got pepperoni, it's got sausage, it's got a nice thin crust on it. It's artisan. Mm. Make sure you tell him I didn't like my pizza. Oh, I'm gonna, don't you worry. Oh no, you can't do that. No, we have to. I can't believe you're doing that. That's crazy, oh man. My God, That's look crazy. At that. Best tiramisu you ever had in your life. I mean, how do I thank you? I mean, really, that's too much. It's a pleasure having you here. She the food was great. The service, man. <laughs> I told him I'm going to go in the back and cry. Uh, you know, hey, at least you can write our looks. Enjoy. If you need to wrap anything up, too, just let us know. Yeah, wrap up the ice cream. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm supposed to be on a diet. I'm then we'll throw. No, we'll keep the glass, too. No, I'm eating that. <laughs> We're going to take this dessert home with us. <laughs> what do you guys think? We can't thank you enough. And I'm sorry, call it whatever you want, but this stuff is too good to not eat and leave. So we're taking it with us. I don't blame you. And it. we're going to have it for breakfast. I love just that. Just to piss my wife off. <laughs> so what do you do here? I serve. Well, that's it? Yeah. I mean, you, I don't want you to lose your job. I can't hire you. Times are up right now. <laughs> but you should get your license. You got the look. You got the personality. I'm telling you, out here, average, the cheap house is a million bucks. Cheap ones. Yeah. You get 30 grand if you find somebody to buy them. No kidding. It's 6% commission. Even if you only get half because you're representing the buyer, 
That's that's three percent on every million is thirty grand. Everything around here costs a million. That's true. Thirty grand. Yeah. If you do one a month, it's three hundred sixty thousand dollars a year. Yeah, that is. It's and true. you can still work here and do it on the side. That's not a bad idea. One course, one test for the state, and that's it. You got a license to make money. You can actually tell that guy in the corner there to hold your license, and you can work out of there and work here. Hmm. Like the way you think. And all these people, you never know, work the shit. This place could feed you all kinds of business. Yeah. I'm definitely doing that. I mean, common conversation. How are you guys doing today? Oh, are you visiting or you live here? Simple question. Yeah. That's real. And then it leads to other stuff. already here. You got them for an hour. I know. Hour. There you go. Yeah. Oh, we're here looking at a place. Oh, yeah. Well, here's my card. I could be your personal real estate agent. Genius. That's absolutely genius. We get a lot of people visit, and I can't tell you how many times people say, oh, we're thinking of moving. And you're getting money here. And I'm going to give you about, I'm going to give you 120 days. 120 days. 120, and I know you can do it in four months. In 120 days, you should have your license. I'm doing it. All right. 100%. Thank you. I appreciate the dessert. Guys, of course. Thanks very much. I enjoyed everything. This is it. If you want the best Italian food in Fort Lauderdale, you're going to come to Louis Borsi's in Las Olas because the service is great, the food is great, the prices are reasonable. Louis Borsi, baby, they'll treat you right. If you got a problem in life or you're thinking about investing in something, who do you know better than me to call? Go to benmel.com slash shop. Consult with Ben. Get me on the phone. Let's make some money. This summer, we tested out the new yacht. We went island hopping in the Bahamas, man. We went down to Key West. We went down to Boca Grande. We went everywhere. While we were in Boca Grande, I hit the jackpot. Look at that baby. And they got my favorite, okay? <laughs> You're not going to find this nowhere else. I'm going to buy some cigarettes, baby. For, ah! for $10. That's right. Same price you get to charge, lady. Here we go. I ain't done this in at least 40 years. Ooh, I took the money, baby. Oh, shit, it gave it back. Come on now. Take that 10, baby. Take that 10. You want my 10? No, I don't know where your money comes from. Come on, I got tens here. This one's gonna work. Oh, shoulda took it. Get it ready, here it comes. We got Newport box here, we got Newport box here. Come on, baby. Look at that, baby. Right out the machine, a fresh Newport in the box. That's a restaurant. On this yacht, everybody's part of the crew. But it ain't always smooth sailing. It takes five of them to dock a little boat. Shit. Oh my goodness, what a crew. Never get the crew drunk before you dock. Frank, you're supposed to be in charge. What kind of crew you got here, Captain? We have a great bill right here. I got it. Right uh, perfect, perfect. We lost a cushion. Probably cost a thousand bucks to replace. Plus two cushions, that's $2,000. This will all be on my report, Captain. The valuable lesson, put the cushions away before you go underway. All right, Captain. All right, we're sitting here on a boat in the middle of the Bahamas at Norman's Cay, but our Batmobile's going up for auction in Orlando. We're gonna sit here and we're gonna handle it right over the phone, baby. Is it gonna sell? I don't know. Looks like nobody's spending the money. If you don't want to spend the money, I'll take it home. Uh-oh, we're losing signal. My Batmobile's getting ready to go across the block, and we're losing signal. Fix the computer, Aaron. The Batmobile is sold. It only sold for 175, but I'll take it. I made 50 grand. On vacation, Carla's always in a party mode. Do it, do it. This is how I spent my it. father's day. You can do it even back to it. So he even corrupted so our stew. Some people just don't know how to relax. Listen, owning a boat to me, or owning a yacht, is nothing but high class water camping, baby. This yacht has seven bathrooms. When you gotta go, you can go. Boring. Check out my bookie. Place your bet. The fight's tomorrow. Subscribe. Watch another video. Hit the like button. Adios, amigos.